Wow, thanks. The actual red envelopes are fine, but on Chinese New Year, get ready for the red envelope madness on China's booming social media WeChat. Grabbing and sending red envelopes on WeChat is a fun and rewarding experience during the festival. Don't take it so seriously if you don't grab one in time. Ask your friend to send out more. But remember, don't be the one who just grab but don't send. Ready to welcome a shop red envelopes? Have fun. If you see someone stop in front of a Chinese character Fu and raise his phone just like me, don't be surprised. We are collecting the five virtual Fu cards from Alipay. Each Fu card represents a different blessing. Once you successfully collect all the five different types of Fu, you can split a 200 million yuan prize with other participants. It is an important custom to set up firecrackers and fireworks during the spring festival. In traditional Chinese culture, firecrackers were originally used to scare away evil spirits. Today, lightning firecrackers is a major custom to celebrate the coming of the new year and also a way to enhance the festive atmosphere. But to avoid air pollution, electronic crackers or e-crackers might also be a great plan B to just do the trick. as they do not emit smoke and also produce light and sound, thereby suitably dubbed as environmentally friendly. So I don't know if you ever tried writing spring couples in English, but I'm gonna do it now, so don't judge. As an important spring festival decoration and with black or golden characters written on red paper, spring festival couplets are composed of a pair of poetry lines vertically pasted on both sides of the front door and a horizontal scroll affixed above the door frame. Writing and pasting spring couplets expresses people's delight in the festival and wishes for a better life in the coming year. On New Year's Eve, when you are together with your family members to enjoy the reunion time, don't forget the Spring Festival Gala, the most watched show on the planet. There's a crew of big time stars on the stage, but they're also full of mockable moments. Therefore, it's becoming a new tradition to brought social media like Sina Weibo, the Chinese version of Twitter, to see how people mock the gala. The show also comes buzzwords and slums for the year to come. So, if you want to join the hottest topic discussion with your Chinese friends, best to sit in front of the TV on New Year's Eve. A lot of people don't really watch the show, but still keep it on as background noise to enhance the lively atmosphere while families and friends chat, eat, and simply have fun. <laughs>